Welcome to Boggy Box Craft. I'm Deborah, and welcome to Nairn. Me and Andy are away on our holidays, and I thought I would take you along and show you our adventures. On our way, we stopped off in Elgin at Johnson's to meet Andy's mum and dad for a spot of lunch. I had the cauliflower steak. It's not something I've ever had before, but thought I'd give it a try and wasn't disappointed. After lunch, went for a wee walk around Elgin. Found this beautiful little garden. It had an absolutely beautiful flower arch. So of course I had to take lots of selfies next to it. And it had the most gorgeous rainbow flower display. Beautiful. So kind of in keeping with my planter at home. Well, not really, but who doesn't love their flowers in a rainbow formation? I could easily have something like this to grow peas up. That's the sort of thing I've been talking about that I could build for you. Oh, I would love that. And then we headed on to Nairn because we're spending a few nights away on holiday. So while we're on holiday, we're staying here at the Loch Loy Holiday Park. This weather is incredible. <laughs> it's like 20 degrees. And I'm in Scotland. Love it. <laughs> This morning we got up, went into Nairn, had a wee shop around. Found some really cute gift shops. Might have bought the dogs a bowl or two, and maybe some dog cookies, because well, they deserve it. And it's the least I can do after leaving them in the kennels. <laughs> they don't care, I bought the bowls for me really, but that's fine. He is having the best this time. What a good boy. <laughs> and now we're on our way to Cowder Castle. Have a look around the grounds and in the castle. Come into my castle. All right then, let's go. That wallpaper is just fabulous. And all the good china. I think this is a really lovely kitchen, even now. Oh, that's for prepping. This guy, I don't know. My guide thing here says it's a duck press for extracting the juice. I presume out of the duck. That's a bit grim, isn't it? I suppose it has got a picture of a duck on it, hasn't it? I think I'll stick with my apple juice. We're gonna let it fall down there. Thank goodness it's got something around it to stop me doing that. Oh, this is so cool. Yeah, it's a fact that I remember mum and gran using skills like that. My mum had a set of skills like that too. Maybe not quite like that, but close. Look at how beautiful all those pans are though. I mean, those dishes. The oven and the top's rotisserie. Oh, holy but toot. See the turning mechanism on it? Uh-huh. It actually speeds up and it gets hotter because it's done by a fan that it comes from the flue. Oh, wow. So it gets hotter and the hotter you ride, it's quicker, it rotates mm. quicker. And then look at this rayburn. I mean, this, this is a cooking place of joy. And this is the ultimate kettle. <laughs> it's beautiful. Just in case you're an army popping over the <laughs> Absolutely. I mean, this is stunning. document these things. Don't often find a cookie and a brownie that is vegan. Be rude to not have it. I think this is what I'm here for. So we're in the gardens of the castle now and it's beautiful. And I thought I'd show you around. The roses are beautiful. I mean look how far up they go. Right up to the roof nearly. 
I mean, that to me is absolutely glorious. Mm -hmm. I mean, that is a climbing rose to be proud of. And this thistle is wild. I can spy one in there that is just about starting to appear. What a fun little bird. It's a bird feeder. They're having a merry little time, aren't they? Just having a little wander around the gardens. They are absolutely beautiful. Beautifully manicured. And it smells divine in here. Lots of lovely paths to follow. Castle in the background. And the water fountain. Look at these thistles. Look at all the bumbles. They are definitely living their best lives. lovely day out this is. Highly recommend coming here if you get the chance. The gardens are gorgeous and the castle is amazing. Such a cute little place to sit. Maze and Paradise Garden. We can go for a walk around the perimeter. Yeah. Absolutely. I don't particularly fancy getting lost in there. These gardens are exceptional. I mean, how did they get these angles? This is beautiful. I'm so impressed by this. Oh, and there are sea pinks in the middle. I'm not sure what the real name is, but well, that's what I know them as. So it looks like they've put netting all over their fruit trees. I might have to adopt this because I think in my garden, the birds have finally figured out where all my red currants are. And this looks like maybe the only way to protect them fully. And behind us is the orchard. Although I haven't spied any fruit. We'll have to go looking a little bit more closely. These trees do look pretty gnarly and old. Apple George Cave. This one does have some fruit on it. Although difficult to see in a lot of these trees, there is a lot of fruit. I think it's just because it's green at the moment. Much more difficult to see. We had a lovely day at Codder Castle. Lovely time was had by all. The gardens are so beautiful. And apparently it takes four full-time gardeners to keep them maintained. I can hardly maintain my own blinking garden, let alone all that room. Anyway, we headed back to the caravan park, had a wee lie down and a chill out, and now we're off to dinner. So I'll see you there. So we've had our meal and it was beautiful. So we're back at the holiday park and I'm just gonna go chill out for the night. Hello, good morning. Good morning. How are we doing? Oh, good, thank you. Kettle's just boiled so we can have some coffee. Get this day started. So I had the most amazing meal last night. Had another terrific sleep, feeling somewhat refreshed. I mean, I look refreshed, but I feel refreshed. So today, I'm not entirely sure what we're going to do. I did spy a dress shop that I really want to go and have a look at. Managed to order off the breakfast menu just in time. So we've got vegan breakfast wrap. So it's been a successful morning, been shopping. It felt like that shop had a dress for every occasion, from everything from what, a size 6 to size 30, so that was ideal. So, a good morning's work. And on that note, we're heading home. Name's been beautiful, I've really enjoyed myself. Me as well. Yeah, it's been great. So if you've enjoyed this video, leave a like, leave a comment, share and subscribe. Of course, subscribing is optional, but it is very much appreciated. So thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Ta-da! Bye! <laughs>